Hello everyone, I greet in the name of God Almighty. My name is Apostle Newton Silas and I'm here with Nancy Grace. You're welcome to my channel, Nancy Grace. Do you have anything to say to the audience? Peace be unto you. <laughs> Amen. Amen. All right, and today we're reacting to Sharif Mustafa, a Surah Al Muda, a heart melting voice, a certain Quran recitation. I believe that is going to be a very interesting one. So guys, if today happens to be the first time of you checking out my channel, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on my Facebook and Instagram. And if you have any video you want me to react to, don't forget to drop it at the comment section. And I'm gonna... So guys, before we get down to the video, I have a theology and I make this video not to discredit anyone's religion. This is basically for educational purposes and I believe that at the end of this video, we're going to learn from it. So guys, let's get to the video. فطهر وروجز فهجر ولا تمنوا وتستكثر ولربك فاصبر فإذا نقر في الناقور فذلك يومئذ يوم عسير على الكافرين غير يسير ذرني ومن خلقت وحيدا وجعلت له مالا ممدودا وبنين شهودا ومهدت له تمهيدا ثم يطمع أن أزيد كلا إنه كان لي لا عنيدا سأرهقه صعودا إنه فكر وقدر فقتل كيف قدر ثم قتل كيف قدر ثم نظر ثم عبس وبسر ثم أدبر واستكبر فقال إن هذا إلا سحر يؤثر إن هذا إلا قول البشر سأصليه سقر وما أدراك ما سقر لا تبقي ولا تذر لو واحت للبشر عليها تسعة عشر وما جعلنا أصحاب النار إلا ملائكة وما جعلنا عدتهم إلا فتنة للذين كفروا ليستيقن الذين أوتوا الكتاب ويزداد الذين آمنوا إيمانا ولا يرتاب ولا يرتاب الذين أوتوا الكتاب والمؤمنون وليقول الذين في قلوبهم مرض والكافرون ماذا أراد الله بهذا مثلا كذلك يضل الله من يشاء ويهدي من يشاء وما يعلم جنود ربك إلا هو وما هي إلا ذكرى للبشر كلا والقمر والليل إذ أدبر 
والصبح إذا أسفر إنها لإحدى الكبر نذيرا للبشر لما شاء منكم أن يتقدم أو يتأخر كل نفس بما كسبت رحينا إلا أصحاب اليمين في جنات يتساءلون عن المجرمين ما سلككم في سقر قالوا قالوا لم نكن من المصلين ولم نكن طعم المسكين وكنا نخوض مع الخائضين وكنا نكذب بيوم الدين حتى أتانا اليقين فما تنفعهم شفاعة الشافعين فما لهم فما لهم عن التذكرة معرضين كأنهم حمر مستنفرا فرت من قسورا بل يريد كل امرئ منهم ان يؤتى صحفا منشرا كلا كلا بل لا يخافون الاخرا كلا I think this recitation was just focusing on the judgment day and what that is going to um, happen. So, guys, let's hear from Nancy Christian. Yes, very interesting video. Yeah. And also, you have said a lot. Mm. And firstly, I want to I want to appreciate the voice. Yeah. He has a very nice voice. Okay. And <laughs> honestly, I mean, kind of emotional mm. video. And secondly, and lastly, what I want to say is just the same. This is the kind of message we have to be hearing in this end time, mm -hmm. honestly, about hellfire. I think it will help us to guide our mind, our thoughts, and be careful the way we live our life. The message have come again is about the hellfire, and also, so I pray yeah. that God just help us. <laughs> Yeah, it was just a very quite uh, interesting one and you know just like we have reacted in some of our uh, the couples of our video we're talking about what angels when god created angels they do not have you understand a will so they do whatever god have commanded them to do and that's why you are uh, listening to the video is talking about in the hellfire god is going to put nine angels and these nine angels are going to guide the hellfire those are the people god have decided to Day. So, which means that there are people who will do exactly as what God wants them to do. They will not try to do anything of their own. And God, in His own wisdom, knows why He decided to put the nine over there to guide and understand the hellfire. And then He makes you to understand that that's a place that will, you'll be there going through pain. You will neither die or live, but then you are just there, your skin is just burning and all that. And that's when He went on to talk about what people who actually be in the garden. That's the believers. Right? When the believers are actually being the candidate, they will ask themselves, what did they do 
you understand? And then from there, they will get to realize that what because of what they do not fear God, they do not obey God's commandment, right? And they did not feed the poor. You know, that's just like it's even used it even in the book of uh, James. James chapter five was talking about that word that the religion that God would uh, recognize is the ones that would, when you feed the poor, you visit the widows and all that, those are the ones that uh, God actually um, recognize. So that's also the same thing, just like it says in the other um, video here, talking about what God is going to say is that what you do not take care of the men that are with you, right? Yeah. So you are supposed to, because you're going to say, oh God, really do we see you that we do not do what you ask us to do? It was like, in a sense, if you visit me, in a sense, I was in the prison, it did not visit me. I was sick. It did not, you know, no kind of thing. I was naked. It did not uh, wear me clothes and all those. And that's what they want to ask our Lord, where did we see you that would not do? So, like, uh, the people that they are there, in a sense, did not do. So, that's why, in a sense, you're here. So, a very interesting uh, recitation, a call toward the self reflection. And the video makes us to understand that God did that so that the, uh, the number of the believers can actually increase. But the kind of world we are actually find ourselves right now, it shows that what the number of the disbelievers are actually much. Yes. And in one of our video that uh, we are actually we are learning, he was talking about that um, God will destroy both the righteous and the unrighteous. When the number of the unrighteous supersedes the number of the righteous, God is going to destroy it. And we could also see example of the uh, Sodom and Gomorrah. When God was even asking Lord that, can you be able to even get even 10? Can you even get even just 10 people? If you can be able to like get just 10 um, righteous people, then I will say, but then you are not be able to. So it's a very scary one. And uh, it's a place that none of us will wish to be in. And I believe that we have actually learned from this um, recitation. So guys, this is the end of our video. If you like our reaction, if you like, share and subscribe. And if you have any video you want us to react to, don't forget to drop it in the comment section and we're going to check it out. So guys, remain blessed.